How a Real Sigma Male Deals with Anger Have you ever wondered why some individuals seem to remain calm even in the face of intense anger? This question, my friend, invites us into the enigmatic world of Sigma Males. These are individuals who navigate life's turbulent seas with an unparalleled level of calm and composure. Now you might be asking yourself, what exactly is a Sigma Male? Well imagine someone who is introverted by nature, someone who prefers their own company to the hustle and bustle of social gatherings. This is a person who embraces solitude not out of loneliness but out of a deep-seated desire for independence and self-reliance. This is the Sigma Male, an exquisite blend of introversion, self-reliance and resilience. In a world that often seems to be on the brink of chaos, anger is a common emotion. It's a response to feeling wronged, to injustice, to unmet expectations, but how we deal with this potent emotion can greatly influence our well-being and the quality of our relationships. Enter the Sigma Male. In the face of anger, the Sigma Male presents a fascinating study. They don't suppress it, nor do they let it explode uncontrollably. Instead they have a unique approach to dealing with this intense emotion. Their introverted nature coupled with their fierce independence allows them to step back, evaluate the situation and respond rather than react. They understand that anger, when handled correctly, can be a catalyst for change and personal growth. But what triggers anger in a Sigma male? After all, they seem to be so in control, so unflappable. Well, like everyone else, Sigma males have their triggers. These could range from feeling disrespected, to having their personal space invaded, to witnessing injustice. However, it's not the triggers that set them apart, but rather how they respond to these triggers. So, as we embark on this journey to understand the intriguing Sigma male, remember this. It's not about suppressing or ignoring anger, it's about understanding it, managing it, and turning it into a force for positive change. Let's delve deeper into the unique ways Sigma males handle anger. Let's unravel the Sigma enigma. Unlike Alpha males who often confront anger head-on, Sigma males have a different strategy. Let's delve into the unique approach of Sigma males when dealing with anger. Sigma males, the elusive, introverted counterparts to the more dominant alphas, have a distinct way of handling anger. Instead of engaging in the heat of the moment, they withdraw, choosing solitude over confrontation. This is not to be mistaken for cowardice or avoidance, but rather a preference for introspection. When anger stirs within a Sigma male, he doesn't lash out impulsively. It's not his style to lose control or allow his emotions to dictate his actions. Instead, he retreats into his mind, his personal sanctuary. Here he reflects on the source of his anger, seeking to understand it rather than letting it consume him. This approach might seem unconventional to many, but it has its unique advantages. For one, it significantly reduces conflict. By not responding in anger, the Sigma male prevents the situation from escalating. He doesn't fuel the fire, but lets it die down naturally. He's like a calm sea amidst a storm, unaffected by the chaos around him. Moreover, this approach fosters self-awareness. The Sigma male's retreat is a journey of self-exploration. He peels back the layers of his anger trying to understand its root cause. Is it frustration? Is it disappointment? Or perhaps it's a deep-seated issue that he's been ignoring. The answers to these questions help him gain insight into his emotional landscape, enhancing his understanding of himself. This self-awareness is a powerful tool. It allows the Sigma male to manage his anger effectively, not by suppressing it, but by addressing it. He knows that his anger is a natural response, a part of being human, but he also knows that he has the power to control it, to prevent it from controlling him. He doesn't let his anger define him. Instead, he uses it as a catalyst for personal growth. Furthermore, this approach promotes emotional maturity. The Sigma male learns to handle his emotions responsibly. He doesn't project his anger onto others or blame them for his feelings. He owns his emotions, taking responsibility for his reactions. This emotional ownership is a mark of maturity, a testament to the Sigma male's emotional intelligence. And finally, this approach fosters peace. By managing his anger effectively, the Sigma male maintains his inner peace. He doesn't allow external factors to disturb his tranquility. He remains calm and composed, even in the face of adversity. His peace is his strength, his shield against the storms of life. In conclusion, the Sigma male's approach to anger is a testament to his unique nature. He doesn't react impulsively but retreats and reflects. He gains self-awareness, manages his anger effectively and maintains his peace. His approach may be unconventional but it's undeniably effective. Sigma males by nature are introspective which helps them manage anger effectively. 
They truly are a fascinating enigma, aren't they? Scene script. Sigma males have unique tools in their arsenal to manage anger. Firstly, let's delve into the realm of meditation. This ancient practice allows the Sigma male to observe his emotions without becoming entangled in them. It's like observing a storm from the safety of a shelter. As the rain of anger pours down, he remains calm and composed within, allowing the storm to pass without causing any internal damage. This emotional detachment is key to his ability to manage anger effectively. Next, we explore the world of physical activity. It's no secret that exercise releases endorphins, the body's natural mood elevators. For the Sigma male, physical activity isn't just about keeping fit, it's also a powerful tool for anger management. Whether it's a quick run around the block, an intense gym session, or even a leisurely walk in nature, these activities help the Sigma male channel his anger into something productive, transforming a potentially destructive emotion into a source of energy and motivation. Finally, we turn to creative outlets. The Sigma male understands that anger, like all emotions, is a form of energy, and energy can be redirected. Instead of allowing anger to consume him, he channels it into his passions. Whether it's painting a masterpiece, strumming a guitar or writing a captivating story, the Sigma male uses his anger as a source of creative inspiration. This emotional alchemy turns a negative emotion into a beautiful expression of creativity. It's essential to note that these techniques are not about suppressing or ignoring anger. On the contrary, the Sigma male acknowledges his anger, understands it, and then uses these tools to manage it. This approach contributes to his mental and emotional balance, ensuring that he remains composed and rational, even in the face of intense emotions. These tools not only help Sigma males deal with anger but also contribute to their overall well-being. So the next time you feel the heat of anger rising within you, remember the Sigma male's approach. Like him, you can choose to transform your anger into something productive and positive. Sigma males view anger not as a destructive force but as a catalyst for change. This perspective is a game-changer, a radical shift from the conventional view of anger as a purely negative emotion. But how does this work? How does a Sigma male transform the raw energy of anger into a positive force? The first step is to understand that anger, in and of itself, is not necessarily bad. It's a natural human emotion, one that signals that something is not right. It could be injustice, frustration, or a personal setback. The key is not to suppress or ignore this emotion, but to acknowledge it, to listen to its message. This is where the Sigma male's introspective nature comes into play. They dive deep into their feelings, peeling back the layers to uncover the root cause of their anger. Once the source of anger is identified, the Sigma male then channels this powerful emotion into productive activities. Instead of lashing out or brooding over their anger, they use it as fuel to drive their actions. This could mean working harder, pushing their limits, or striving to right a wrong. They don't let their anger control them. Instead, they control their anger, guiding it in constructive directions. A significant aspect of this process involves self-improvement. Sigma males are constantly seeking to better themselves, and they use their anger as a motivator in this pursuit. If they're angry about a personal flaw, they work to overcome it. If they're angry about a missed opportunity, they strive to create new ones. They see each bout of anger not as a hurdle, but as an opportunity to grow and evolve. Furthermore, Sigma males use their anger to improve their circumstances. If they're unhappy with their current situation, they don't just sit and stew in their anger. They use it as a springboard, a motivator to change what they can and accept what they can't. They channel their anger into efforts to build a better life, not just for themselves, but also for those around them. Anger, when harnessed correctly, can also be a catalyst for creativity. The intense emotions can spark new ideas, lead to innovative solutions and drive artistic expression. Sigma males, with their independent and unconventional thinking, often use their anger-induced creativity to break new ground, to challenge the status quo, and to make their unique mark on the world. In essence, Sigma males have mastered the art of alchemizing anger. They've learned to transform this fiery emotion from a destructive force into a potent tool for change. They don't let their anger consume them. Instead, they consume their anger, using its energy to propel them forward, to drive their actions, and to fuel their growth. By harnessing anger, Sigma males turn a potentially negative emotion into a positive driving force. This is the power of the Sigma male's approach to anger. It's not about suppressing or ignoring this emotion, it's about understanding it, channeling it, and using it as a tool for positive change. Sigma males don't just manage anger, 
they transcend it. Unique in their approach, Sigma males navigate the turbulent waters of anger not by suppressing it, but by understanding and transforming it. This process begins with the pivotal act of self-reflection. Just as a mirror reveals the contours of our face, self-reflection lays bare the depths of our emotions. It's a journey inward, a deep dive into the heart of the storm. Picture a Sigma male in the throes of anger. He doesn't lash out, he doesn't retreat, instead he pauses, steps back and observes. He asks himself, why am I angry? What has triggered this emotion in me? He probes, peels back layers and uncovers the root cause of his anger. This is introspection, the Sigma's secret weapon against anger. Now imagine the transformation that follows. With the root cause revealed, the Sigma male can begin to address it. He doesn't attack the anger, he addresses the source. He might realize that his anger is due to feeling disrespected, or perhaps it's a result of unmet expectations. Whatever it is, he acknowledges it, confronts it, and sets about to resolve it. The process doesn't end there. The Sigma male takes it a step further. He uses his anger as a catalyst for self-growth. He asks, what can I learn from this? How can I grow? He doesn't just want to manage his anger, he wants to evolve from it. He turns anger into a teacher, a guide directing him towards self-improvement. Finally, the Sigma male emerges from the storm of anger, stepping into the calm after the tempest. He's not the same person who entered, he's grown, matured, evolved. He's learned to transform his anger to use it as a tool for self-growth. This is the Sigma's journey from anger to calm. It's a journey marked by self-reflection, introspection, and growth. It's a journey that doesn't just manage anger but transcends it. Anger when understood and managed can be a stepping stone towards inner peace. What can we learn from Sigma males about managing our own anger? That's what we're here to dive into for the next three minutes. Sigma males, those enigmatic self-sufficient individuals, are known for their unique approach to anger management. They are not immune to anger, but they handle it differently, with a cool, collected demeanor that many of us strive for. So, what are their secrets? Firstly, Sigmas practice mindfulness. They don't just react impulsively, they take a step back and observe their emotions. They recognize the surge of anger but don't let it control their actions, instead, they analyze the source, understand its root cause, and then decide on the best course of action. This practice of mindfulness allows them to respond rather than react, keeping their anger in check. Secondly, they practice self-care. A healthy mind resides in a healthy body, and this is a mantra that Sigma males live by. Regular exercise, a balanced diet and sufficient sleep are non-negotiables. They understand that physical well-being directly impacts emotional health and helps in managing anger more effectively. Thirdly, Sigmas are excellent communicators. They express their feelings assertively, not aggressively. When something upsets them, they don't lash out or suppress their anger. Instead, they communicate their feelings clearly and calmly ensuring that their message is understood without causing additional conflict. Fourthly, they don't dwell on negativity. Holding on to anger is like drinking poison and expecting the other person to die. Sigma males understand this. They don't let past grievances cloud their present. They let go, they move on, they don't feed their anger, they starve it. Finally, they practice forgiveness. This isn't about letting others off the hook, it's about freeing themselves from the burden of resentment. By choosing to forgive, they're choosing peace over anger, serenity over turmoil. So how can we incorporate these strategies into our own lives? Start by practicing mindfulness. Take a moment to observe your emotions without judgment. Understand why you're angry, and then choose your response. Prioritize self-care. Engage in physical activities that you enjoy, eat healthily, and ensure you get enough rest. Remember, a calm mind resides in a healthy body. Communicate effectively. Express your feelings assertively, not aggressively. Be clear and concise, and avoid blaming or criticizing others. Let go of negativity. Don't let past grievances affect your present. Learn to let go and move on. And finally, practice forgiveness. Remember, forgiveness isn't for the other person, it's for you. It's about choosing peace over anger, calm over chaos. Incorporating these strategies into our lives won't make us immune to anger but they can help us manage it more effectively. They can help us react less, respond more, and ultimately, live more peacefully. In the face of anger, we all can choose to be a bit more Sigma. In the end, being a Sigma male isn't about being aloof or detached, but about understanding and managing emotions. The Sigma male's approach to anger management as we've explored is not about suppression, but about understanding. 
It's about seeing anger not as an enemy but as an informant. It's a signal, a red flag, telling us something is not right. It's an invitation to explore deeper, to understand what's really going on beneath the surface. By doing so, the Sigma male is able to maintain his equilibrium. He doesn't let anger control him. Instead he takes control of his anger, he uses it as a tool, a catalyst for change, and in the end he emerges stronger, wiser, and more resilient. What's more, this approach allows him to maintain his independence, his self-reliance. He doesn't depend on others to soothe his anger. He doesn't need external validation or approval. He finds balance within himself. This, in turn, leads to a greater sense of calm. A calm that's not just a temporary state but a way of being. A calm that comes from understanding, from acceptance, from insight. A calm that's grounded in reality, not just wishful thinking. And it's this calm that the Sigma male embraces. It's his sanctuary, his refuge. It's what allows him to navigate the world with grace and dignity, even in the face of adversity. It's what gives him the strength to stand his ground, to hold on to his values, to stay true to himself. So if there's one thing you take away from this, let it be this. Embrace calm, embrace introspection, embrace understanding. Because at the end of the day, that's what being a Sigma male is all about. It's about being comfortable in your own skin, it's about being at peace with yourself. It's about being able to stand alone without feeling lonely. It's about being self-reliant without feeling isolated. Remember, it's not about suppressing anger, but about understanding, managing, and ultimately transcending it.